Now to a major money story today that impacts anyone borrowing cash. The Federal Reserve is expected to hike interest rates for the sixth time this year, this time by another three quarters of a percentage point. News Nation business contributor Lydia Moynihan joins us now. So when will these rate hikes end? I asked this to an economist this morning. He said years. What do you think? Well, I think the economists would know more than I would, but um, speaking with people who are watching the markets and interested in this, I mean, this is the fourth 75 basis point in hike in a row. We basically started this year at zero, and we are looking to maybe end the year closer to 4.5% in terms of interest rates. So, you know, what market watchers, though, are looking at is this, this 75 basis point hike already seems bike, baked in to the market, but the real question is, what is Jerome Powell going to say? That is the, the important person who needs to answer this question of when rate hikes will end. And people will be watching closely for anything he says that suggests it could be coming to an end or um, you know, anything he says that could provide guidance on that front. So ultimately, well, so Lydia, we're when you say it's baked in, sorry, when you say it's baked in, that means we shouldn't see the markets freak out today, right? You know, th that's what market watchers say. I, I'm not necessarily going to take responsibility for that comment, but I, I do think <laughs> most people speak with at this point because um, of a lot of reporting are expecting to see a pretty substantial, uh, you know, hike there. But again, markets markets freak out for crazy reasons. No, Lydia. Okay, uh, that's Lydia. She's live in New York, but I'm going to hold you and only you personally responsible for whatever happens on Wall Street today. Thank you. Just know that's hanging right over your head. Okay. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.